Welcome to bashscripts.info. Today we're going to start uh, looking at checking our Gmail accounts in Bash. We're going to go over uh, in the next few tutorials different ways to do that and different ways we can use that information to do different things. Uh, but today we're just going to basically look and see, uh, look at our new messages. Um, and what I found out recently is that there's a website, uh, part of Gmail, if you go to uh, mail.google.com forward slash mail forward slash feed forward slash Adam and you have to be logged in to your Gmail account it will give you this quick little feed of uh, mails, new mails that you have not opened yet that are in your inbox so we're going to use that and we're going to access that in bash uh, and just to see what new messages we have so let's go to our bash window here and we're going to use wget today um, and the way we're going to use it is very simple uh, wget is a very simple uh, command line interface for downloading and viewing files from the internet we have videos on it in the past but we're going to simply use it today wget uh, and then we're going to set a secure protocol that we're going to use and the secure protocol we're using is TLS v1. Uh, this is a predecessor to SSL if you're familiar with SSL so it's similar to like that. That's just from what I've read that's what we gotta use for the Gmail here. Um, next thing we need to input is our username uh, such as Metal X 1000 and then we put in our password like so uh, password and then whatever your password is my password is not password I'm just using that as an example today and then we put in the uh, web address that we want to go to which is the one I just talked about uh, https uh, colon forward slash forward slash mail dot google dot com forward slash mail forward slash feed forward slash Adam and uh, that would automatically save it to a file called Adam we want to display the output to the screen and the way we can do that is a switch of a capital O and then just a dash and uh, I'm going to hit enter now it's if I hit enter now it's not going to uh, actually work because that's not actually my password or my gmail uh, account name but uh, that's the basic command. Let's put that into a file. I'm going to go, I'm going to just call it um, oops, bash mail.sh. Go in here. I'll start off our script like we always do uh, with our pound asterisk forward slash uh, bin forward slash uh, bash. I said exclamation, or I said asterisk, I meant exclamation point there. Anyway, we'll paste in our command here. To make it easier to read, we can do this little comment line and actually break this command up on two separate lines. So that's what it would look like uh, right now in, in a script. We can save that, control X, uh, and then Y, enter to save that file. And then we would change the mode and make it uh, so that we can execute the file. And I've already created another script called my mail. Same thing, but with my real email uh, user, Gmail username and password. So if I press that now, we get the HTML output of this same page here. So what we're looking at here is the same here. This is just the HTML code for it. You can see, if we look at this, you can see that uh, one of my new emails is a reminder to get uh, my wife's car's uh, tires rotated and we can see that same thing right somewhere right here now in the next tutorials that we're going to go over we're going to go over uh, grepping out uh, information in there and grabbing information that we want so uh, thank you for watching this video Get ready for more coming soon. Filmsbychris.com for more tutorials like this.